Hi guys, welcome back. Question 20 here. Our answer is 66.7 kilograms to one decimal place. So this is an example of a question where a patient has a target BMI in mind. What you need to do is you need to use the patient's height and the target BMI to then calculate a new weight for the patient. And then we need to work out how many kilograms the patient needs to lose. So we have our weight already of 140. We have their new weight with the new BMI that we're going to work out. And the difference is what they need to lose. So using the formula provided, calculate how many kilograms the patient needs to lose to achieve their target BMI. And we need to give our answer to one decimal place as well. Another thing to note with this question is that the formula that you need to use, whenever you do use a formula, you must make sure that you are using the correct units. Now with this question, our height needs to be in meter squared. However, in the question itself, our height is 176 centimeters. So we need to change 176 centimeters into meter squared. So what we need to do is we need to convert the centimeters into meters and then into meter squared. So 176 centimeters becomes 1.76 meters. 1.76 meters times 1.76 meters is your answer in meter squared. Now we have our target BMI. We have that part for the equation. We have our height as well. So what we need to do is we need to rearrange the equation, which is what I've done in step three. You rearrange it to make the weight the subject. The weight is 73.258 kilograms. We know they weigh 140. They want to weigh 73.258. So our answer is 66.7 kilograms to one decimal place. Answer is correct because it's given in kilograms and we've answered to one decimal place as well.